Hey, what's up mga Dorbling? So we are born guys for this new video. So today's video is I'm gonna show you how you can play PUBG Mobile using mouse and keyboard in 2023. Yes, pareho lang tong setup sa dati kong video. Ginawan ko rin kasi ng video on COD on how to play mouse and keyboard sa so COD Mobile. Ganun. Nung napanood nyo na yung video na yon, is same thing lang yung gagawin natin dito. Kaya pwede nyo i-apply. Pero syempre kung hindi pa, watch lang kayo hanggang dulo. Syempre like and subscribe kung gagana sa inyo to. Madali lang gawin to, promise. So ano pang hinihintay natin? Let's go! Ito guys, ito yung mga kailangan nating gamit to play mouse and keyboard on PUBG Mobile. So first thing we have here, the Tilex keyboard. Dito siya, 100 keyboard. Meron lang ito sa Shopee. 200 plus lang. 200 to 300 plus. I will put down the link in the description. And actually, lalagay ko lahat ng mga nagamit ko dito sa description para di na kayo mahirapan maganap pa. So there you go. And then next thing right here, we have a mouse. You can use any mouse that you want. Actually, this keyboard too. Pwede ka naman gumamit ng ganitong keyboard and any keyboard you like. I just like this because para matipid siya sa space. And 100 keyboard lang siya. We have here, I'm using a Fantech mouse. As I said before, you can use a mouse, any mouse you like. And the next one is this Dugdut converter right here, which I bought from Shopee. I think it is 500 something like that, 400. I will put down the link in the description for all of this product. Same thing lang to sa COD as I said before. Same setup lang, same items din ginamit. And then again, a power brick to power this Dugdut converter. And lastly is the phone itself so i'm using the mi 10 t pro you need a phone to play a pubg of course ito lahat yung gagawin din natin for today's setup so ayan setup na natin first na gagawin natin is to power this bluetooth converter by plugging in yan plugging in natin tong power cable natin so let me plug in right here and then actually, kahit naman pwede nyong i-insert ito sa PC or any device na merong power, it's up to you. I just use this power brick kasi ito lang yung choice natin ngayon. So, saksak ko lang. Once na nasaksak nyo na or na-power nyo na yung Bluetooth converter, mag-light siya dito, of course. And then next thing we wanna do is to get the keyboard cable. Ito siya, i-port natin dito, i-plug natin dito sa Bluetooth converter. And then there we go, na ilaw na yung keyboard natin. RGB keyboard din pala ito. Next thing is itong mouse, of course. RGB din to actually. So, boom. There you go. RGB din to. Medyo maliwanag lang dito sa lighting ko. Kaya di masyadong kita. And then once na na-plug na natin lahat ng mga components or yung mga peripherals, kuhanin natin tong phone natin. So, there you go. Open nyo lang yung phone natin. And then go to Play Store. Play Store. And then search for Shooting. Plus V3. So there you go. So as you can see, I have now already the shooting plus V3. Install nyo lang to. Konti lang MB nito. Hindi naman makakapiak to sa storage nyo. Pag na-install nyo na tong app mismo is you need to open this. And then agree-agree lang kayo dito. Okay. So yun. Permission daw sa floating something like that. And then hanapin nyo lang dito sa ilalim. Shooting V3. And then on natin dito. So there you go. Hindi naman to virus or anything security. And then allow. Allow, yun, allow. So, okay. Right here, it said device disconnected. Sana makita nyo. Ayaw mag-focus sa camera. Ayan, sabi niya, device disconnected. What we need to do right now is to click that device disconnected and matik siya pupunta sa Bluetooth. So, let's turn on the Bluetooth. Hanapin natin yung shooting plus V3 and for me, of course, nakakonect na ako dito. Hanapin nyo lang dito. Refresh, refresh lang kung di nyo mahanap. Just like that. What we did is, nag-connect tayo dito sa Bluetooth converter. So, Bluetooth to phone, something like that. So, once we are connected, go back. And then, there you go. Refresh nyo lang to. Pag wala pang app na lumalabas, refresh nyo lang. Exit nyo lang yung mismong app. And then, open again. Pag na-open na, allow. So wait nyo lang. So as you can see, please wait. And then boom, lilitaw na mga app dito. Right there, we have the rules of survival, Minecraft, COD Mobile, and then the PUBG itself. Of course, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can play on the PUBG. So let me click this thing and then download F1. Download lang natin dito yung F1 para kon para matik mamaya. Mamaya papakita ko. Once you downloaded that, and then we're gonna go home. Then look for PUBG. PUBG Mobile, click na natin to. Open na natin yung PUBG Mobile. And as you can see, we have this floating area, I mean floating icon right here. Just leave it right there. Hintayin lang natin mag-loading to. Nag-load na yung mismong app, which is yung PUBG Mobile. First thing you wanna do here is to go to settings. Punta muna tayo sa settings para customize natin yung layout, yung controls mismo. Customize button and then customize natin dito. 
So as you can see, ito yung mismong layout niya. What we need to do right here is to control F1. Click nyo lang sa keyboard nyo. Control F1. Ayun, nag-set na siya. And then click natin yung icon, yung pinakita ko kanina. Click natin to. And then, dilita ko mga keys. You will see all the keys, icons, yung mga F, something like that. And makikita nyo, hindi pa sila masyadong nakaset ng tama. We're gonna manually set this thing. The left click is the gun, the shoot button. The right click is the aim or the shot. So, ito siya. Yun, there we go. Lalagay natin doon yung shot. Yung R sa reload, lagay nang natin dito. Yung space button doon. So, yung space, of course, yung jump. Just like that. Lalagay natin sa jump. Yung C, ikakabit natin sa crouch. Ito siya. And then yung V, ikakabit natin dito sa yung gapang. Yung gapang-gapang. Hindi -gapang. ko alam kung anong tawag doon. And then yung control, ila-align na lang natin dito. We are now set. So let's go save this thing. Okay. Na-save na natin. And then, yeah, we're gonna go back. Exit na natin to. And let's see in the game itself. So play lang natin dito. Start. Hintay lang tayo ng match. So, nandito na tayo sa lobby. Ayun ko anong tawag dito. So, let's try. So, click W. Oh my goodness, guys. So, as you can see, it is now fully working. So, let me click the left click. Kung susuntok ba siya. So, right click and boom. So, there you go. Look at that. So, yes, it is now fully working. C for the crouch. Tingnan natin. C. Wow. So, there you go. V for the gapang-gapang. Then, there you go. Look at that. So, space. Ayun, tatalon siya. Space. Space space so there goes so as you can see it is now fully working guys lang duda gumagana na siya guys yeah you can control this if you really want to yun nag game siya bigla let me show you a example of a game try ko maglaro ng game using this keyboard and mouse let's see if this thing will work so yes <laughs> Okay. I'm scared of getting there. Oh. I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. I'm going to Guys, hindi ko na tinapos yung mismong game. Wala akong nakitang kalaban. Hindi naman yun yung purpose ng video na to. Pinakita ko lang dito is paano mag-connect or how to use a mouse keyboard on PUBG Mobile. When I think napakita ko na and sana gumana sa inyo. Wala sanang problema. So yes, that's it for the video for today. I hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Stay tuned with my new videos. You know, puso. Alright guys, peace. Bye-bye. See ya, see ya, see ya. See ya.